Today we're heading to Penang and I am definitely gonna miss this view. Look how beautiful, but I'm also excited about trying all the delicious food. I heard Penang food is really good and we are driving there, so it's about four hours. So I'm excited to see how nice the drive is. I think it's gonna be beautiful. Okay, you guys do the last check and then we're out of here. We are just getting ready to check out of our Airbnb. Our wonderful driver slash friend Jeffrey is waiting for us downstairs. He will be the one driving us to Penang today. We met Jeffrey about a week ago and he is a local. He is just the nicest person. He got the kids some snacks for the ride. We had two ways of getting to Penang and it was either fly or drive. And we opted for driving because we would get to experience the beautiful views. Flying from KL to Penang is only about an hour and is extremely affordable. If you book in advance, you can even get tickets for as little as 20 to 30 Canadian dollars per person. Our trip with a private car cost us about 800 ringgits, which is right under 250 Canadian dollars. You can also go from KL to Penang using a bus or a grab. This was just the most convenient option for us since we were traveling with our kids and we had some luggage with us. Plus, Jeffrey was so informative and he educated us about so many things on this drive. The nicest driver, right? Wherever you're from, you find your people there. It looks like this one has a if you guys want to see more of what we did on our trip to Malaysia, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. <laughs> it's similar. No, no, no. Penang is more like the island. Uh, what is it called? Yeah, and he's just telling us about Penang, uh, no, where we're beach, going, which we're going is called Penang. Penang? Yeah, so it's basically like an island, yeah. uh, but it's connected by road. So it, I mean, this one we don't have to take a ferry to because it does have, like, I believe, two no, if you, roads I think it's running. Better if you oh, nice. Stay uh, so I'm excited to see like, how that is. Maybe it's like a bridge or something. Said, you know, let's yeah. just do Penang. And right now we're in Kuala Lumpur. And it's very interesting. Yeah, so I said, you know what, maybe let's try Penang first and then we'll see maybe after. Penang has a very important We could fly to Penang also. We ended up pulling over to a rest stop so we can grab some breakfast. The first place we noticed was Dunkin Donuts. We ended up getting a chicken sandwich from here because we didn't notice any other restaurants. Jeffrey told us there were more restaurants, they were just a little hidden, so we went and found a KFC, a Burger King, and some other local places. We're just gonna, we just stopped to eat. KFC. And this is like their en route? Yeah. The en route is like really big. It's really big. It has a lot of restaurants. We have some outdoors too. And it also got something from Dunkin' Donuts. So we got some KFC popcorn chicken. Yeah, and we wanted that. And then we got, I think, a burger, I think. A zinger. Baba got a burger. A zinger. A burger. And then we got, ooh, oh, overloaded. I don't know how that's supposed to look. <laughs> No, that's way too much, you guys. We were not gonna be able to eat, uh, eat it wait, like that. Oh, hey, get, go, get, go get forks from there too. Baba's still there. No. Or oh, actually, there's one in here. There's a spoon in here. Oh, oh, oh yes. a spoon. You got napkin and there's some French fries. So what? I don't know what. The, oh, this isn't even in French fries. It's in uh, 
chicken. Yeah. Is it is it in uh, mashed potatoes? Yeah. Okay, this is not what we wanted, but that's okay. Whatever. We usually get it in fries, but super cheesy. Delicious. And then we also try. You can have the fries in here, there, right? We can. We can dip the fries in there, and then we also got some Dunkin' Donuts sandwich. Sure. Then we got our Dunkin' Donuts sandwich. This is uh, the chicken mayo. Look at that. Struggles of opening it. Ben, did you have fries in it? So we're gonna dump the fries in here, okay? Let's see how that is. Tiny bananas like the ones in Pakistan. Uh, in Thailand, did you orange? Yeah. It's a little bit different. The color is a little bit different. It's a little bit like more um, more yellow. Because the bananas in Canada are more like white. On the camera, but it's more yellow. Okay, time to try this small candy. Okay, this is the strawberry flavor fruit sweeties. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what is the average salary in Malaysia? It. Like, what's the average? Okay. Let's just say you have a professional so job. Tiny. What okay. is the average salary? Three thousand? Four thousand? Degree holder so, is a degree holder. Our driver's holder. telling us this is Malaysian uh, candy. Point. We say that tricky. Okay. That's right. Can you open my tip? Yeah. yeah. And you know that they call it the uh, OH fund. You three years. It's a efficient fund. Is it a retirement fund? Yes, retirement fund. We call it that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So. Personal is uh, the shop design. Reminds me of uh, strawberry ice cream. Paid in twenty five percent of the salary. Obviously, it's uh. How much? Is income I don't really like candies, but this one's good. Income tax. Are we gonna try these ones? Mango candy, but then it. How do you get a family doctor? Thai chili. You gotta wait this for one year, two years, you get a family doctor. I'm super excited about it. Yeah, it's because of all the family doctors. It's kind of like. Spicy and sweet. Right. Well, at the so, yeah, yeah. Like healthcare is free. Kind of like Chili Millie's one. Healthcare is free. Kind of like that. Uh, like uh, like uh, uh, like uh, 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 I don't like Chili Millie's. Like so I wonder how this is going to be. I do like mangoes though. Medical, yeah? At least they're small. Can't be that bad. Yeah. Smells like chaat masala. Okay, we have our water, right? Because I think we're gonna need water. Okay. Yeah, the water, the water is in the back. It's just full of leaves. Fresh water, fresh water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I take these guys, I put them in the car. Uh -huh. Say, a little picnic, we go. Go. Oh, right. All day. Okay. It's a hard candy. We catch fish. Uh, the mango. Eat food, mango first. The chili is on the inside. Yeah. 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 The mango tastes really good. It tastes yeah. like yeah. a green yeah. mango. I love fish, yeah. right? So not like a sweet mango, like a, like you know, like the sour mango. I think I'll bite. Very nice fish. So it tastes good so far. Okay, I'll be mine too. I like more sport fishing, you know. I don't do a lot of. I don't keep too much fish. Only, only one type of fish we keep because it tastes very good. Okay, so I go okay. for sport game fishing, you know, like ah. catch big ones, bigger ones, put it back. Oh! Is it? Is it? 
We stopped again at another rest stop and the kids noticed Baskin Robbins so we got some ice cream. It was really nice to see that most of the rest stops in Malaysia have a prayer area. At this point, we were really close to getting to Penang. We decided to stop again and it was raining, but the rain felt so good because it was also very hot. Jeffrey made sure to stop at this rest stop in particular because it had a lot of fruit stands. But it's so good. Wait, I've always wanted to try this thing, but it's so good. And I'm trying it on the other side. You saw the durian snack? That's 
Smells right? Oh, you like the smell. Let me okay. Yeah, the outside. Yeah. Outside. You like the smell okay. No, it's not that bad. Okay. I think inside is different. So we got some fresh mangoes and they cut it up for us. They're and so then nice. Oh god, this is okay. Now I'm gonna want some leech. It's hiding in there. It looks it's hiding in there. So Maybe that's the home that's the cat's home. There's a lot of stores in there too. We don't want anything, right? No, we don't want anything. Okay. <laughs> it's so fresh, right? It's so good. It just keeps spinning every time I try to the bite of it. I mean, yeah, you get your stick out. No. It's hard to just protect that. It's, it's very close to Pakistani mango. Look, look, look. Very close. Thailand. Thailand. It's pretty sweet. From Thailand, yeah. Very sweet. Pakistan, no, no stock here. But Pakistan is very nice. Very big. Mm -hmm. Why are you doing that? No. After about a 5 hour drive because we stopped a few times, we finally make it to Penang. We decided we would stay at a resort in Penang because we wanted more of a relaxed environment and the resort we're staying at is in Batu Ferangi. Okay, we're taking a little break because the car's heating up, so we're almost there. 40 minutes, I think. 30, 40 minutes. 30 minutes? 39 minutes. 39 minutes. Okay, so that's pretty close, 40 minutes. And then we saw this cute little park here, so we're just going to walk around here and the kids are going to play at this park. Oh, how pretty. So different from the city, right? I mean, it's different from KL. It's a little more like, even more, like, na it's nature-y, I guess. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute, right there, recycled. I have a little... Got everything up here? Okay, we're just waiting to go up. So, yeah. We're just waiting for Shari to come back. It is. It's almost like an elevator from Aladdin. Yeah. Doesn't it look like that? Like very like Arabian. Okay, here's the master bedroom. The bed is really big. Like, I've never seen a bed this big before. The lighting is a little bit dim in here. I don't know why it's so dark in here, but it's nice nonetheless. A TV, a little sitting area where I can do my makeup. Decent. And I think we have some covered space over here. Safe. Storage. Not bad. And then the washroom here. Okay, so we do have a tub. Which we haven't had in any of the places we've stayed in so far. Vanity space. 
and a shower. Nice. And then, as soon as you enter, like our luggage, this is like the living space. Living space, okay, nice. Hi, Afia. Uh, has a small couch, a TV, some water bottles, and Afia and Amina's bed. And we, oh my god. This is probably like the best part. We have the we have a balcony. And you can see the beach and there's and a horse on the beach, a real horse on the beach. Oh my god, this is like insane. The best part about this room is probably this. Look, there's a beach. You can see the beach there. And uh, I think they're doing something there so you can see. Oh, this that is beautiful. There's a real horse. And the beach is, yeah, the beach is right there. Yeah, and there's a real horse walking, a black horse. No, really? Yeah. Did you see a... Yeah. Wow, maybe you guys can get a horse ride. Wait, that's maybe. It. Right there, Where? you can see it in the corner. I think we're going to all the way in the back over there. Someone's riding it. Like, where the last tree ends, there's a horse in the back right there, walking around. This is so nice. So they have, a, like, a lot of boats over there and stuff. So I bet you could do, like, some water activities. Now, everything's and, so and that's the pool area. A basketball court. And there's a the pool. pool. Which we can't, we can only see half of the pool from here. I bet there's more stuff on the side, like the slide. Honestly, there was. Yeah. It's coming, dude. It's coming, look. I don't know if I can. There it is. I don't know if I can see it. Oh, I see it. It's right there. There it is. You can get a horse ride. Yeah, you can get a horse ride on the beach. Also, when he when he actually this is our balcony space. Two chairs. That's it. We made it. There are definitely some pros and cons to this resort. We found the rooms to be, although functional, a little bit dated. Aside from the rooms, the outdoor space, the restaurant, and the staff, everything else was great. This resort does have direct access to Batu Ferengi Beach, which was amazing. And in comparison to other accommodations around this area, this place was really affordable. The resort also had some great amenities and I will leave a link to this resort in my description box for anybody oh, wow, who is interested. Super cool. Oh, no. She's looking. Raja. Wow. I want to get kicked by a horse. <laughs> The beach is much bigger than it looks from up there. Yeah. Right? They usually down there, baby. That's why they have a dug it dug out like this. What happened? The beach is much bigger than it much looks. Much bigger than yeah, don't hold the whole beach. The beach literally goes along like the coastline all the way through. But we're so so the jellyfish tank. I'm coming in. You found a shell? It's a unicorn horn. Okay, let's see. That looks really cool. I'm gonna keep it. Because there's nothing inside it. Yeah, you should. By the time we got to our resort in Penang, it was already evening and we were pretty hungry, so we decided we would go look for a place to eat. This resort is not all inclusive, so our food is not included, but that was fine with us because we did want to try some food in Penang. There were lots of local restaurants right in front of the resort, so that's where we decided to go. No, I want to join the restaurant and sit down. Do you want to get a saute? Yes, I would love to. What is the saute? Well, let's go try it. Let's just see what they have. We'll just get something that like, we kind of know. Can we get shrimp? No. Yeah, let's go see. Okay. No, no I'm okay. <laughs> Maybe come around this way. It's kind of cool. There's another white one in there also. But the most, all, the rest of them are yellow. Can I get that? Yeah. I really want sea kebab. I love sea kebab. Well, it's like 
chicken skewers, basically. The owner of that restaurant was so funny and nice. He asked us where we were from and when we said Pakistan, he said he knew a couple of Bollywood songs and then he sang us a Bollywood song, which was really funny. And that's it for our first day in Penang. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you did, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel so you don't miss anything. I hope you guys have a wonderful day.